When you first open your math, this is what you'll see. All your assignments starting at the bottom with the first one. Set your goal question. If you zoom out, you'll be able to see more of the assignments still starting with goal question at the bottom. Once you answer your goal question, it'll appear at the top and the rest of the map will move around it. Notice you won't be able to move anything else until you do the assignment. Once you do the assignment, the question will pop out to the left and you'll be able to add new items to your map. Here I've added a new reference paper. Now all the cards can be moved, the ones you've added that are new and the ones that pertain to assignments you've already done. Now I've moved some cards around, I'm rearranging my map. Now here's an example from a previous piece of software of a map that's not been rearranged. It just reads left to right in chronological order. But here's one that has been arranged. You can see multiple questions coming off of content, multiple pieces of content coming off of questions, really trying to organize it as the person has learned the material. Here's another similar example showing two main branches of inquiry that this person has gone through to try to understand their big goal question. And finally, here's one with content hanging off of questions, lots of content and answer of each question. So try to arrange your map so that it shows how you've learned.